Referee for tonight's match is Joseph Dickerson. He has been in charge of 44 career MLS matches. As RSL hasn't been to North Texas since 2019. To have it not turn into a shot on target, I think, is going to be frustrating for Freddy Juarez on the RSL touchline. Here is Rubin. Turns, left-footed effort, and he tucks it inside of the right post. Rubio Rubin continues his hot scoring form early in this 2021 MLS season, and Real Salt Lake have taken the lead in the 20th minute. This moment, clearly, we sort of didn't see it there, but right before we got that picture, it was Matt Hedges giving the ball away, and then he overruns the play a little bit. Now they've got Rubin scoring goals uh, practically in his sleep. You have to wonder unless... Oh, here's a giveaway and a deflection saved by Ochoa sliding all over the place. Hara got the shot off. High weather in Utah last weekend. He did not handle every shot toward him very well. Here's a header down, fought off by Ochoa. Credit to the young U.S. men's national team call-up as the keeper makes the save. But everybody else is zoning there, so you got to find it. Off of Herrera, gets it back, and now Vargas pulls Glad out to the middle. Obreon. A post of left foot. Ochoa just did enough to knock it over the crossbar and under the top of the net. We have corner kick number eight for Dallas already in the opening half. Acosta went long. Lucarte had trouble focusing on under the pressure. And now a penalty. Yes, indeed. There were initial appeals. A bit of a delay. And Joseph Dickerson is pointed to the spot. And I, I think it's, uh, well, first of all, you got to credit Obreon for putting himself in a good position there. Looks like it's really just more clumsy than anything else there from Marcelo Silva. But it's... Ochoa, Hara. Puts it right into the right corner. A comfortable, calm, cool finish. This is a penalty kicks, and to be quite honest, there were some mixed results there, but that was a good one at a nice placement, just enough power. We're in the 44th minute, 1-1 of the opening half. We're hearing there'll be one additional minute of stoppage time. Acosta went for the long effort. It hit Ricarte. Hara, second effort, and this one just shaves the outside of the post. I think he slipped as he took the shot, and it's going to be a corner kick. Vargas turning the defender, threw it in off of Ochoa. Another bicycle kick attempt. Hara this time is on frame, and Ochoa comes up with an excellent save. Dallas really starting to come alive in the attack. Hassan. Hollingshead is pushed forward on the left side. First touch to Pomacol. They have a very good chemistry this time. Hollingshead in on the right foot, slashes it, and it's in! Ryan Hollingshead has pulled FC Dallas in front in the 84th minute as the veteran smashes one home for his first goal of the year, his 16th career MLS strike. 2-1 FC Dallas all the time that in the 80th, 85th minute, he's still getting forward. This is FC Dallas' left back, remember. Picks up a loose ball there. FC Dallas scored twice today, which means that you get half off a regular price menu item tomorrow. But Papa John's scored twice. And just like that, Real Salt Lake is equalized in the 86th minute. Not good from FC Dallas. Great response from Real Salt Lake that FC Dallas doesn't deal with. It looks like Krylock gets the header. And he does. And Joma has to charge back. And that'll do it as Joseph Dickerson blows the final whistle, bringing this match to a close. And the points will be shared tonight. RSL will be pleased. FC Dallas will feel a little bit dismayed.